We're gonna show you the top 10 most registered baby products according to Baby List. We have them here and we're gonna show you why parents are obsessed with them and why they have them on their registry. And at number 10, we have the Frida Baby Meta Frida AccuDose. It's dishwasher safe and it's BPA free. So this is supposed to give you an accurate dose and with the pacifier in baby's mouth, it will be pointing towards their cheek which will bypass their taste buds, which actually is supposed to prevent them from spitting the medicine out or throwing up. Yeah, because giving your kid medicine is tough. So I understand why this is something that's on your registry. Everyone should have this. And number nine is the first year's American Red Cross Baby Healthcare and Grooming Kit. And it's $24. I can see why every parent would want this on their registry. First thing, boom. We got a nail clipper. Yes. Necessary. Very necessary. Because honestly, like, you don't want to use the big nail clippers. Cause like kids nails, they grow so fast all the time, yeah. but like using your own adult nail clippers for the Not little insane. ones, it's, a, yeah, it's, it's a little scary. scary. It's scary. <laughs> Honestly, even this one's scary, but it's good to have, it's good to have. <laughs> so we also have this soft tip medicine dispenser. Yeah, put the medicine in there. This little soft tip goes Great. right down. Separate toothbrushes. So yeah. for your infant, you have a finger one that you can go ahead and help them with and then they have a first one for when baby's ready to brush their own teeth. This is a parent must have. And must. honestly, this alone is usually like 10 bucks. Yep. So the whole kit is worth it. But this is a nasal aspirator. When baby is congested, it's hard for babies. They don't know how to blow their nose yet. So you need something to suction it out. What's nice about this specific one is the bulb actually opens on the back. So you can clean out the inside. A lot of the bulbs um, are closed and it's Hard to know if it's clean on the inside, it's probably not. Now you have a thermometer. You definitely need a thermometer. There's scissors in here too, and there is a comb that you can use the mirror. And then last but not least, we have a little baby brush for on the go. When you're dealing with babies first, anything cold, <laughs> nail clipping, anything, you need this kit because when these situations arise, you don't want to run out to CBS. So with the first two items being medical care, it's no surprise, right? Because the minute you start your registry, you're gonna research a lot of things, but the things you know you need are the medical things. So for number eight, we have Burt's Bees Baby Organic Burt Cloths. They're coming in at $22, but it's this specific burp cloth that made the list in this color pattern. I don't know about you, but I know at my house, these are everywhere. So yeah. they're on my couch, they're all over the place, <laughs> and at least they'll like blend in. Someone will just think like, oh, that's just the part of your couch. No, really, it's got all my kids spit up on it. But yeah, so I get why people like this specific color pattern. All right, so if you're looking for burp cloths and a clean fabric, these are very popular. They're very soft. So soft. And since you can add anything to your baby list registry, this is from Amazon, but it's number seven most registered on baby lists. It's the Hakka silicone breast pump, which I know nothing about. Kayla? <laughs> so I have a few of these and I'm obsessed. So basically, if you are the breastfeeding parent, you can attach this while you're breastfeeding or even while you're not breastfeeding to collect your milk. So basically fold back the flange. This is the newer version. So the flange is larger. And so you fold it back and then you just attach and you squeeze and then plop this back and it suctions to you collecting milk. And yeah, for me, this is super convenient. I'm not surprised it's on our list. I think a lot of people love this. And even if you're not breastfeeding, say you might be engorged and you have milk that you're trying to get rid of, this is a great way to get that out and relieve any pain that comes with engorgement. So number six on our list is the Boone Lawn Dryer Rack at $25. This one is supposed to imitate a lawn, so these are blades of grass. You can use it as a dryer rack for your bottles, also your pacifiers, and you can add separate attachments like flowers and add to your lawn. If you don't clean this and look at the bottom, make sure you clean this because what you're putting on here is bottles and wet things. And you gotta make sure that like you clean this so you don't grow any mold here. You don't get any black spots here, anything like that. And number five, we have Pampers Swaddlers disposable diapers. And I gotta tell you, Kayla, this should be number one. So anyone watching this making a baby register, listen, Pampers, diapers should be number one. I'm impressed that just diapers in general are number one, but these were actually the only diapers on the list and these are actually from Amazon. So 
very interesting choice, but it's a great price point at 96 diapers for $28. And they're hyperallergenic and latex free, which is nice. They also come in such cute patterns. So I'm not gonna lie, they smell good. You know what they smell like? Let me give the viewers a visual. They smell like when you get a brand new baby doll. <laughs> That's what it smells like, and it's, it smells like powder, maybe. But anyways, they smell great. Register for diapers. You're going to need them. You're going to need a lot of them. So if you're buying a friend something for their baby, buy them diapers. If you're going to a baby shower, bring some diapers. If you're registering, Add diapers. It doesn't matter what size diapers you buy because at most places you can return those diapers for bigger sizes or you can return them for, you know, something else that you want. But diapers are definitely a good thing to buy. And just another tip, guys out there watching this, if you're looking for a gift to give your friend who has a kid and you're like, I don't know what to get a baby, just get a box of diapers. All right, so on number four, we have the Shine Arc Baby Car Mirror at $22, which I'm not surprised about this being on the list. We all like to see our babies when they're in the car seat, especially in those early stages when they're rear facing. So this one's nice because it's large enough that baby can even see you at the front seat. It also attaches to the seat with these little straps. And what's nice about this one is it also, you can just angle it really easily, which I know some, the one that I had, was terrible because I couldn't do this and it just kept falling in the wrong angle. So this one's nice and sturdy. I really like that. It makes sense that it's on the list. No, it makes complete sense. And for someone who like we were new parents at one point where you're taking the kids to doctor's appointments when they're a month old and you can't see them, it's honestly like terrifying. This is something that is definitely, that makes sense that it's on the registry. Maybe it should be a couple steps higher a little bit. I think this is really important for people to use. It's not until you're in the car when you're like, oh shoot, I can't see them, <laughs> that you realize like, oh, I really do need to get the car bear. <laughs> the Frida Baby Bitty Bundle of Joy. And this is $50 and it has a lot of things that you are definitely going to need as a parent for sure. Anything Frida Moms, Frida Baby, just take my money. I know I need it. It is important. All right, so first up, this is the Windy. The gas passer. So with the Windy, it is to help baby pass gas because in the early stages, it's difficult for them to do it on their own. So you will insert this like a rectal thermometer and there is a safety stopper on here. So you know how far you should go. Up next, we have the nail clipper. You're gonna need a nail clipper. Baby's nails grow fast. Very fast. And so this one's nice because it's a safe version for baby. So up next, we have the Freedom Mom Perry Bottle. So a Perry Bottle is what you need after you give birth to cleanse your area, your lady bits. But this one comes with a nice angle. So at the hospital, you'll get one that does not have this angle at all. This one gets you just right. Basically to keep you nice and clean when you might not be able to wipe. It's a portable bidet. This one needs a drum roll for itself. Seriously, the nose, Frida. Babies can't relieve themselves of their mucus. Mucus gets blocked up in, in their nose. While you have a bulb nasal aspirator, like we showed previously, this one is one that you can actually suck out the snot yourself. Yeah, but listen, before you're like, oh, I'm so grossed out by we this. We know what you're thinking because we thought it. There's a filter. You can't get any of this in your nose. Trust me, you can't get mouth. any of it in your mouth. <laughs> oh, in your mouth. Yeah, definitely not your nose. You get the most mucus out with this one because yes. you were actually applying the pressure. And also, it's quite satisfying when you get it out. You stick this part up baby's nostril and you get a little more out if you plug the other side and then you just suck. There's filters, reusable filters. You gotta clean There will up. be mucus in clean there. Clean after every use. Every use. Uh, every use. Coming in at number two, we have Sophie the Giraffe Teether, which is really popular. It's coming in at $27. It is 100% rubber and it also squeaks. Yeah. And this is number two, so a lot of people want it. Yeah, a lot of people want this. And honestly, it's because it's so big on social media. It's so many celebrities use this thing with their babies and like they have their own Instagram page. So I was not sold on Sophie until about two seconds ago. <laughs> and it's because I always thought it was solid, but if you touch it, it's actually really airy, which is nice to teeth on because if you're a breastfeeding parent, you know the babies like to teeth on you because it's like stretchy and flat. <laughs> Sorry. But this is just like that, so this is necessary. And the number one most registered or most wanted item on baby list is 
I promise this isn't rigged. The baby list bottle box. <laughs> This thing is amazing and I wish I could have had this on my baby registry so I understand why this is number one. The baby list bottle box starts at around $33 and that is a steal because honestly, these two bottles that we're holding right now, the Nano Baby and the uh, Como Tomo bottle, probably cost you over $30, just these two bottles alone. And there's more bottles in here. And there's more. <laughs> the baby can actually reject the bottle, which means they're not eating. Yeah. So it's important what bottle yeah. you get your baby. Like literally we'll slap it out of your hand. And yes, at and cry. a couple days old, we'll tell you, no, I'm out of here. <laughs> so what's nice about these, you get a few different shapes, different nipples to try out. Another thing we love about this bottle sample box is they're all BPA free and dishwasher safe. Yeah, there's five different bottles in here. We've showed you some of them, and I mean, you can't go wrong with the bottle box. That's why it's number one. All right, so that was our top 10 most registered items for Babylist 2022. Did you see anything that surprised you or anything that interests you that you're gonna register for? Let us know down in the comments below.